Welcome everyone to Mr. Adobe where you get prime educated videos on Adobe Premiere, Adobe Photoshop and Adobe After Effects. Before getting into the video, please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Without further ado, Mr. Adobe will be guiding you through today's video. Hello everyone, welcome to another cool and easy to follow tutorial on Adobe Photoshop. Similar to the previous video, I'm going to show you guys how to insert images into text. If you have seen the previous tutorial, I only use a single picture. But here we will be using different pictures for each letter of the word love. There is only a slight difference. So first and foremost, import any number of images that you require in your project. For instance, I have imported four images of four distinct ladies as you can see on your screen. Now I'm dragging my first image into the newly created document. Here I'm going to place all four pictures side by side. To do so, adjust the size of the first image so that the other images fit alongside it. Again I'm dragging the second image into the new document. Same as before, I'm adjusting the size of the images in order for them to fit alongside each other. Since the picture is too large, I need to crop out sections of my images. You guys can follow along. Select layer 2, that is the second image. Now using the rectangle mark tool, determine what parts of the image you want to crop out. Here I'm using Ctrl plus Shift plus I to delete the unwanted parts. Zoom in to make precise adjustments. Repeat the same process for the third image. After that, I'm selecting layers 1, 2 and 3 and moving them to the left so that I can fit my fourth image. Similar to me, take your time to adjust your images until satisfied. Now for the final image, repeat the process again. After aligning all four pictures, select the layers 1, 2, 3 and 4 to place them right at the center for ease of access. Now we can add the word love one letter at a time. I'm going to the toolbox and selecting the type tool. You can follow suit or type your preferred words best for your final image. However, for this demonstration I'm starting with the letter L. Now I'm aligning the letter L as per my first image. Then right click on layer 1 and select create cloning mask. This will add the image to the letter. After that adjust the layer 1 so that the best part of the image is seen inside the text. You can do it by using the shortcut Ctrl plus T. We are done with the first image. You can now follow the same steps for the remaining 3 images. Almost done. Now I'm selecting both the image layer and the text layer to move the letters into place. You can see it on your screen. Adjust the spacing between the letters as per your preference. Now making final adjustments, select all the layers except the background to move the entire word into the center. You can do it as per your preference as well. Ta-da! It's finally done! Okay guys, that's it for today. If you liked the video, please thumbs up and let me know if you thought it was helpful in the comment section down below. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe us for more interesting tutorials on Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Premiere and Adobe After Effects. Till then, stay original, stay creative and have a good time!